EPS, we're, we're largely in the automotive aftermarket wholesale distributor, but we're also in the um, leisure and industrial um, sectors as well. We've worked with KCS now for 23 years. Um, we started with Rev7, upgraded to 807, then 809, and then last February to Babbage. Well, it supports all our transaction processing um, end to end, so it's, it's our lifeblood really to, to, to support our business. We're in a very dynamic industry. Um, there's lots of market forces driven by customers, suppliers, the market itself. Uh, we're constantly changing. That means lots of changes in the software. That means we engage constantly with KCS. I've been with the business just under two years and we've made, I'd say, a hundred projects in that time, most of which have um, involved a change with, with KM. Next for us, we're upgrading to, to Babbage 02. So we're currently on Babbage 01, so we're taking the first feature release, which is quite exciting. It should be a small step for us, but it brings a few new features and it'll be our fir first experience of loading a feature release. We're very much interested in the delivery management system. That's um, a, a module within Babbage, and we're actively engaged on that. We're looking at business intelligence, data warehouse, and CRM. I would recommend KCS, but it's like any other business relationship. You've got to work at it. It's a two-way thing. No software house will just come and deliver everything you want because they don't understand your business, so you have to put time and investment in sharing your business model and processes with them. Both organisations, KCS and FPS, have been working really hard at the relationship, getting to know each other, our cultures, our business processes, both sides, and then working together, and that's really paid dividends. And that's what I'd stress, really. It's about the effort you put into it. That's what business relationships, commercial relationships are about, whether that's software or manufacturing or supplier distribution, whatever.